Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. I'm Lamia Morshed, Executive Director of the UNUS Center. Thank you for coming out to Savar this morning to grace our event with your presence here at Ganeshastu Kendra. Good morning and welcome. This is a very important day for all of us. It's a social business day. And the more important thing that uh, we could gather together in one place, coming from so many different places and so many different activities we are all involved in. And uh, that's what it's all about, uh, Social Business Day, getting friends together. So this is a gathering of friends and we celebrate that occasion that uh, all the friends from uh, within the country and outside the country and many other countries where they are involved in social businesses. Sadoshima, ambassador from Japan, to address the audience and give his views on this. Thank you very much. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Dr. Yunus. Happy birthday to you. I believe that we see Felicimo, we can do it. Ever since we got to know Professor Yunus and the climbing group, this has accelerated and more ideas came up, more action were taken. That's for the first time maybe social issues and environmental issues came together and uh, it is clear, and it's clear for us as the only environment, that it's impossible to solve environmental issues only for the rich. And if the poor people on the planet do not benefit and are not part of the game, it will be going to be a terrible failure. And uh, let me assure you that really uh, social business brings happiness to people. And we all need to join in this, especially for our country, countries like ours, to develop the people who have not received the facilities that we receive. Uh, thank you very much. Okay, now, as just mentioned by Professor Yunus, my first visit in this country was five years ago, in July 2007. Uh, I must admit very humbly that many of you have a very longer, uh, I would say, companionship with uh, you, Professor Yunus and, and Gramin, but actually, we came. <laughs> Not only we came, but uh, yes, we made an agreement in a few days about the basic principles and intentions of this new initiative we wanted to take all together, which gave birth to the Grameen Critical Foundation. But all I wanted to say, this is the most exciting moment of our life, to hear an astronaut describing his experience while he was uh, in the outer space. Resources and the technology to overcome almost all the challenges facing our planet. And nearly a billion people do not have access to clean water, 
Countless go to bed hungry every night and many die from preventable and incurable diseases. We live in a world where the possibilities are limited only by our imagination and our will to act. It is within our power to eliminate the suffering and the poverty that exists on our planet. So if we have the resources, if we have the technology, why do these problems still remain? I believe that the answer to why our world still faces so many critical problems is, in spite of our ample technology and resources, lies primarily in our inability to effectively collaborate on a global scale. What you're seeing in this video is the global scale. It's a scale where natural and man-made borders disappear. It's a scale where people and organizations set aside their differences and work together toward their common goals. They set aside their differences and realize that we're all riding through the universe together on this spaceship that we call Earth. So I'd, like to, I'd like to present this to you. Amader, Amader Gorob Korar Kikurum, Baki Yatse, Kompot Gomti Yatse. Yeah, that's the last thing in the principles of social business. Do it with joy. That's what we did. Do it with joy. We spend the whole day together. <laughs> 